It's the knockoff Chanel bag for me. Ah, uh, how dare you! She really thought she ate. I got an A on my math test. Period. Period? Do you need a pad? How was dinner, honey? Ate and left no crumbs. You're adopted. This is my 13th reason. What is yours but mostly used by others? Huh? Mom, what is this riddle? It's happening. Answer it quickly. Do it. Okay, okay. What is yours but mostly used by others? <laughs> think, Giselle, think. Your name. Yes, I got it right. Good job, honey. You got your first riddle right. Okay, but can you please explain to me why I had to answer it? Everyone is given riddles to answer, but if you don't answer correctly, you die. Giselle, what do you think about the riddle system? I think it's so stupid. I got my first riddle this morning. I just got a riddle. Okay, what is it? It's, what has to break before it's useful? What has to break before it's useful? <laughs> I don't know. Time's running out. Say something. A glow stick. They're really killing people. What comes up but never comes down? <laughs> Can somebody help me? Please be rich, please be rich. $69? Great, my soulmate's broke. Have you found out how much money your soulmate has? Um, yeah, my soulmate's broke. How broke? He's only got $69 in his account. I, I'm so sorry. Yeah, anyway, how about you? Mine has 50000 50000 Yep. Congratulations. You just spent $20? Are you kidding me? This sucks. Mom, Mom. Yes, honey? I need to talk to you. About what? Is there any way I can get a new soulmate? Why would you want to do that? Well, because mine's broke. That sounds like a you problem. You know, maybe your soulmate has a good personality. Yeah, well, a nice personality isn't going to pay for my appointments, is it, Jessica? Please be an exciting family. An ordinary family? Who wants to be in an ordinary family? Hey, Anne. How dare you speak to Lady Anne? Whoa, what are you guys doing? Guys, it's okay, she's my friend. I chose to be in a royal family. These guards have to protect me at all times. No, that's so exciting. Hey, babe. Um, hey, Jake. I almost didn't recognize you. Where'd you get the new outfit? I chose to be in a rich family. They have hella money. Wow, lucky. Did you choose your family yet? No, I've already declined two families. Giselle, you only get three chances to choose a family. If you decline all three, something bad happens. I didn't know that. Well, you better accept the third one you get. Yeah, okay. Please be a good family. I don't want anything sketchy. A mafia family? That is the definition of sketchy. Please, just be taller than me. My soulmate's one foot five. <laughs> what, is he a gardener gnome? Mom, something horrible has happened. What happened, honey? My soulmate's one foot five. Giselle, there are people that are dying. Go to school. But... Go to school. Whatever. Damn, why do you look so mad? My soulmate's literally one five. Aw, short king. Can you stop it? My soulmate's 5'7". At least yours is normal. Giselle, I've been thinking and you're not tall either. Olivia, please. I'm 4'11". If he's not taller than me, he needs to grow up. That's a little harsh. Truth hurts, hun. Hi, I need to put in a complaint. About what? My soulmate. He's 1'5". Oh dear, let me go check on that for you. Thanks. There's been a mistake. Your soulmate's actually 6'5". Only say words that start with D. Dude! Sissy, I got a D on my test. What's mom gonna say? Disgraceful. She's gonna say I'm a disgrace? Giselle, how does my outfit look? I want to impress Jake. Disgusting. What do you think he's gonna do when he sees me? Dip. Ugh, you're such a bad friend. Dramatic. Do you think the new guy is cute? Duh. I'm going to call him over. Don't. Hey, Liam, Giselle wants to ask you something. Hey, Giselle, uh, what did you want to ask me? 
date. A date? Should I pick you up at seven? Definitely. I think you're a sweet girl. Dream. Wow, you think I'm a dream? Donkey. You're saying I'm a donkey? Dog. Dang it. You can only say words that start with S. Stupid. Sweetie, does this outfit look okay for my job interview? Mm -mm. Scary. You think it looks scary? I worked so hard on it. Sorry. How do you think I should dress for my date? Simple. Hmm. Something simple like this? Slay. Class, today you're going to tell each other what you want to be when you grow up. Giselle, you can go first. Shooter. Excuse me? Slut. And that's a detention. Shit. So you're the girl with the questionable career choices. Shut. You're kind of cute. Space. Give me a kiss. <laughs> Smelly. Stop. Please have the red heart. Please, please, please. I got the red heart. That means I'm the prince's soulmate. Hey, mom, guess what? Giselle, is, is that the red heart? Yes, it is. I'm the prince's soulmate. Do you know what this means for us? Yeah, it means we'll be set for life. Go report it immediately and don't tell anyone. Jessica, I need to tell you something. Okay, so tell me. I'm not actually supposed to tell anyone, but I'm going to tell you because you're my best friend. Come on, just tell me. I got the red heart. I'm the prince's soulmate. Giselle, that's not good. What do you mean? Why? It's rumored that something really bad will happen to the prince's soulmate. You'll disappear. Wow, I had no idea. You have to cover it. Nobody can know you have it. Yeah, I will. Thank you. Did you hear the news? What news? Jessica's on her way to the prince. She has the heart. No, that's impossible. What? Why? Because I have the red heart. You can only say yes. Yes. Sweetie, does this dress make me look fat? Yes. You really think that? Yes. You're such a disappointment. Do you know that? Yes. Giselle, will you do today's homework for me? Yes. Really? I wasn't expecting you to say yes. Will you do the whole week's homework for me? Yes. Oh my gosh, thanks. You're the best. Yes. Class, today we're doing a pop quiz. Yes. Giselle, you seem really excited about the quiz. Yes. Should we throw in a surprise presentation too? She better say no. If she says yes, she's done. Yes. Hey, babe, I think we should break up. Yes. Wait, so you want to break up too? Yes. You're cheating on me, aren't you? Yes. Hey, Mom, what's the time? I don't want to be late for school. I don't know, honey. Fine, I'll check myself. Giselle, no, looking at the time is now forbidden. If you look at it, you'll die. Promise me you won't look at it. Yeah, I won't. There you are. I've been looking for you. Oh, hey, Lizzie. Did you hear about the time thing? Yeah, it's insane. I can't believe we're not allowed to look at the time anymore. Come with me. I want to show you something. Okay, so what did you want to show me? Watch this. Hey, Steve, will you please check the time for me? I'll let you do my homework. Sure, it... No, don't... Why would you do that? You knew he would get killed. Oh, relax. I didn't think he'd actually do it. Sorry, class. They're here to confiscate the clocks. This is getting out of control. They're taking all our clocks. I mean, it is safer this way for us. Yeah, I guess. Oh, Giselle, I have something for you. Come on, please be a good name. Idiot, what kind of name is that? There's no way I'm accepting that. Hey, Mom. Hey, hun. are you named yet? No, the option they gave me was idiot. There was no way I was going to accept that. Remember, you only have two chances left, or you're going to be nameless. Yes, I know. I'm going to school. Hey, have you got a name yet? Nope, how about you? Yep, you can call me famous. Your name's famous? You seriously accepted that? Yeah, it's cool, isn't it? It's kind of lame, don't you think? I bet they're gonna name you something like idiot. Uncultured? 
I'm so cultured. I'm not accepting that. Uh, this is gonna be my third name. If I get this, I'm gonna have to accept. Queen? You broke my heart way back in August. It's been too long. I don't want this. Feels like everything to leads me back to you. Back to you. Dis-moi qui est le plus beau Qui t'a devenu au mégalo Viens donc chatouille mon ego Allez, allez, allez Age? What does that even mean? Hey mom, why does it say age above my head? That's your ability. My ability? Yes, everyone gets one, and yours is that you can see people's ages. That's so lame. Honey, stop being so ungrateful. Now go to school. Hey Giselle, did you get your ability yet? Yeah, mine is so dumb. I can see people's ages. How about yours? I can see people's darkest secrets. Seriously, did everyone get a cool ability except for me? Pretty much. Sucks to suck, nerd. Damn, I wonder how old our new sub is. He's 69. How do you know that? Just my dumb ability. Hey, I'm new here. My name is Liam. Um, congrats. Do you want a cookie? You're 117? How do you... She's got no idea how I'm really feeling. I'm in love, I'm in love, I'm in love with the girl next door. My rating needs to be at least a four. A 3.5? My parents are gonna kill me. I'm putting that on private. Hey, Mom. What rating did you get? I hope you got at least a 4. Um, yeah, actually I got a 4.2. Honey, that's great, but why is it on private? Oh, you know, I don't want to make the kids at school feel bad. Oh, that's my girl. Always so considerate. Yeah, I gotta go. Hey, loser. What's your rating? I'm assuming it's like a 1. Um, for your information, I actually have a 4.2. If your score is that high, why is it on private? I don't want to make you feel bad about your... 3. You did not just say that. Okay, cut the crap, Giselle. I know you don't have a high score. I already told you, Caitlin. I have a 4.2. I guess it's a good thing they're making everyone's scores public tomorrow. They're gonna what? Honey, today you'll be able to pick between fire and water. Be sure to pick water, okay? But why can I pick fire? Stop asking questions. Just pick water. Do you understand? Yes, I understand. Hey Giselle, have you picked water yet? No, I kind of want to pick fire. I want to know what happens. What? Are you crazy? Promise me you'll pick water and not fire. Okay, okay. I'll pick water. And that's it for today's lesson. Any questions? Mr. Bates? Yes, Giselle? Has anyone ever picked fire? Why do you ask? You're not thinking of picking fire, are you? Oh, no, no. I'm just curious. Well, no. Nobody's ever picked fire. And nobody should. I see. How dangerous can it really be? If we're not meant to pick it, why is it there? I'm gonna do it. Giselle, no! Disappear and stay? What does this mean? It's a new form of population control. People can vote for you to disappear or stay. Why do you look worried? Well, Dad, because I haven't exactly been nice to people. Everyone's gonna vote for me to disappear. Oh, honey, it's going to be okay. Just try to apologize. Looks like it's finally payback time for you making fun of me all these years. I understand. I'm sorry. Hey, Giselle, remember that time you cut my ponytail off? Jessica, that was in middle school. Can't we just forget about that?
Actually, we can't. You never even said you're sorry. I'm sorry. Giselle? Jake, hi. Remember that time you cheated on me? Look, I told you I was sorry. If I could take it back, I would. Well, you can't, so... Hey, um, Giselle? Look, just vote for me to disappear already. I never really liked you, but... Hey, Mom, I'm going to the library to go study for finals. Honey, wait. Don't you maybe want to go out with some friends tonight? I don't really like going out. Besides, I need to study. I want to get good grades so I can get into a good college. Yes, I know, hun. I just want you to have fun while you're young. I am having fun. I gotta go. Giselle, there you are. Jessica, what are you doing at the library? It's a Friday. Don't you have some crazy party to be at? Actually, I do, and you're coming with me. I really can't. I really need to finish studying for finals. Finals is two weeks away. No wonder your innocence is on 100%. Come on. Okay, okay. Only this once. I can't believe I convinced you. Me neither. I feel so out of place. You'll be fine. Come on, let's go get drinks. Oh, no, no, no. I don't drink. It'll help you loosen up. Come on. Drink this. Ugh, what is in this? What, don't you like the drink? Hey, loser. Sup, weirdo. We have to do our handshake. Come on, why do we even have a handshake? You always mess it up. I mess it up? Are you sure you're not talking about yourself? I mean, whatever makes you sleep at night. Hey, I won't be able to sit with you at lunch, but I'll see you after school. Is that cool? Yeah, no, that's cool. KK, see you later. So, are you going to tell him? What do you mean? Tell him what? Are you going to tell him that you're in love with him? <laughs> are you crazy? He's my best friend. I'm not in love with him. Come on, Giselle. I see the way you look at him. Besides, if you're not going to tell him, you're going to regret it one day. Is everything okay? You know, I was thinking maybe you're right. Maybe I am in love with him. Well, then you need to tell him. Yeah, I'm going to. Right now. There you are. I have something to tell you. Me too. I just scored a date with Jessica. Isn't that crazy? Hey, uh, Giselle? Look, just vote for me to disappear already. I never really liked you, but... You voted for me to stay. Why? You're always mean to me, but I don't think anyone deserves to disappear. Thank you. I promise I'll try to change. Guys, look at him. He's such a loser. Hey, leave him alone. Look who's talking. You're a big bully yourself. Yeah, well, I'm trying to change. <laughs> you could never change. Shit, I forgot my pen. Hey, you could borrow mine. Wait, really? Thank you. You're welcome. Mom, I'm home. Do you have your report card? Yeah, it's right here. Look at this. You got all D's. You're such a disappointment. You don't mean that. Oh, yes, I do. I think it'll be better for you to just disappear. Mom, please don't. You don't really leave me much of a choice. Mom, I'm home. Do you have your report card? Yeah, it's right here. Look at this. You got all D's. You're such a disappointment. You don't mean that. Oh, yes, I do. And I think it'll be better if you just disappear. Mom, no, please don't. You don't really leave me much of a choice. What's going on here? Dad! Mom voted for me to disappear. Is this true? Yes, she's just a waste of space. You know what, Giselle, just come with me. Dad, what's going on? It's time I tell you the truth. She's not your real mom. Are you serious? Yes, I'm sorry. I never knew she would treat you like this. You lied to me my whole life. I only need one more vote to disappear, so I'm going to go find someone to give me that. Hey, I know you hate me. Can you please just vote for me to disappear? Why would you want that? Look, just do it. Um, okay. Hey, I know you hate me. Can you please just vote for me to disappear? Why would you want that? Look, just do it. Um, okay. No, I said vote for me to disappear, not stay. But I did vote for you to disappear. <sighs> what? You must be the one. The one? What do you mean the one? I can't tell you here. Come with me. Can we stop running and you just tell me what's going on? There's a rumor that there's a person that's unable to disappear no matter how many votes they get. And I think it's you. <laughs> me? Why would it be me? Because when I voted for you to disappear, it went to stay. People are going to come looking for you. You guys, there they are. They found us. We have to go.
Okay, I think we're safe here. What are we gonna do? I haven't been completely honest with you. There isn't only one person unable to disappear. There's two, and I'm one of them. So you're one too? Yes, and here's what we need to do. Good morning, honey. Good morning, mom. What's this? Oh, that's the percentage of how much someone loves you. Wait, so you love me 100%? Of course I do, honey. You're my daughter. Hey, bestie. Hey, Jess. You only love me 10%? You're supposed to be my best friend. What do you mean? Of course I love you more than that. I can't believe you. Hey, babe. Hey, Jake. Gee, if your love for me is that low, why are you dating me? What are you talking about? You know what? I don't even care. It's over. There you are. Can we talk? Jessica, I already told you. I don't want to talk to you. Wait, I figured it out. Your mom lied to you. That's not how much someone loves you. It's how much they hate you. Please give me someone I like. Michael? As in Michael from my Spanish class? He's so weird. No way. Hey, Giselle, have you picked your soulmate yet? No, it literally tried to give me Michael. As in Michael from your Spanish class? Yeah, and there was no way I was picking him. Yeah, good call. <laughs> Jacob? He's literally my boy best friend. I can't date him. So, any soulmate yet? Still no. You only have one more chance left. Whoever you get next, you're gonna have to accept them. Mr. Fitz? Yes, Giselle? What happens if you don't accept any of your options? Then you'll be declared soulmateless and you'll be alone forever. Oh, no. Hey, Dad, I'm headed to school. You want me to give you a ride? Um, no, that's okay. I think I'm going to take the bus today. Hey, Giselle, do you want to skip school and come to the mall with us? Um, I don't think that's a good idea. I have a really important test in science today. Come on, boo, you're so lame. Sorry, guys. Hey, psst, Giselle, can I copy your math homework? I really think you should do it yourself. Ugh, but you know I suck at math. Hey, um, do you want to go on a date with me? Yeah, I'd really like that. Awesome, I'll pick you up at six. Sounds great. Giselle, can you stay after class? Sure. You wanted to see me, Mr. Fitz? I need to talk to you about something. I really need to get home. Giselle, there you are. Can we talk? <laughs> Jessica, I already told you. I don't want to talk to you. Wait, I figured it out. Your mom lied to you. It's not how much someone loves you, it's how much they hate you. You're making that up. My mom would never lie to me. No, I'm telling you the truth. Okay, look, I don't understand. Why would she lie? I have no idea, but I promise you I was telling the truth. <sighs> I'm gonna go talk to her. I'll call you later. Mom? Honey, you're home. Can I talk to you for a second? Yes, of course. About what? Is it true that you lied to me about the percentage? No, I would never lie to you. So you're telling me that that is not a hate percentage, that's a love percentage? Okay, yes. I lied to you. Why would you lie to me? I broke up with my boyfriend and I almost lost my best friend. Well, why do you think mine is on 100%? He's still sleeping? I mean, it's only 7 a.m. Maybe he gets to school a little later. Hey, Giselle, what's your soulmate up to? It says he's sleeping. How about yours? Mine's at a strip club. Your soulmate's at a strip club on a school day? That's what it says. He sounds wild. Do you think your soulmate goes to our school? From what I've seen, I don't even think he goes to school. He's driving right now. At least he's out of bed. Mom, I'm home. Honey, your dad and I are going out to dinner tonight, so you'll be home alone. Hey, have fun. He's hopping over a fence? 
What was that? Hey, put your hands where I can see them. Um, He still hasn't kissed anyone? That's so sad. Hey, Becky. Hey, girl. Has your soulmate kissed anyone yet? Nope. His kiss count is still zero. Dude, that's so lame. I know, right? I really hope my soulmate doesn't end up being a nerd. Psst, Giselle, Jason's throwing a huge party tonight. Are you coming? Duh. You know I would never miss a party. Great. I'll see you there. Oh my gosh, Giselle, you made it. I told you I wouldn't miss it. They're playing spin the bottle over there. Do you want to join? Yeah, let's go. Giselle, you go first. Okay. Damn, Jacob. Puck her up. It's your turn again. It landed on Lucas. I am not kissing him. He's weird. You kind of have to. Take a picture with my crush. This is going to be so easy. Hey, Caleb. Hey, Giselle. Can you take a picture with me real quick? It's for my task. Yeah, of course. Ugh. Oh, no. Is something wrong? My storage is full. How am I supposed to complete my task now? Why don't you just download the Terabox app? I'm sorry, but how is an app going to help me complete my task? This app gives you over a thousand gigabytes of storage. Just upload your pics and videos to the cloud. Great! I can take the picture now. Smile. Cheese. Reason? Starting today, you'll be able to choose how you die. You'll be getting three options, and you have to accept one of them. Okay, well, I'm not accepting this one. Drowning is too harsh. Have you chosen how you die yet? No, not yet. Have you? Yeah, from a train crash. You accepted that? I just figured it could be way worse. A plane crash? No way. I love traveling way too much. A car crash? I can't accept that one either. I don't want to fear for my life every single time I get into a car. Hey, do you know what happens when you decline every single option? Nobody knows. We just know it's bad. I guess that's a chance I'm going to have to take. Giselle, no. I'll take anything, even ten minutes. Looks like loser Giselle didn't get any hearing time again. Why is she looking at us? Oh my gosh, she's waving. Should we wave back? Absolutely not. Let's go. Class, welcome our new student. You can go sit next to the little blonde girl at the back. I wouldn't sit there. She can't even hear you. I think I'll sit there anyway. Thank you. Hey, so what's your name? Right, I forgot you can't hear. Her name's Loser Giselle. Always has been, always will be. Hey, I know you can't hear me right now, but I have something to give you. I really hope this works. Wait! I can hear you. So you see. If you ever go astray from me, I want to thank you for your love. This life gonna be what you wanted to be. Fiction happens right. Or does it just happen like how we pass? A hundred dollars for every time I say yes? I don't know if that's the best idea. You have to accept it. You'll finally be able to buy your new car. I guess you're right. Let the yes day begin. Hey, I have a question. Be honest. Does this look ugly on me? Mm, yes. How could you say that? We're friends. You did ask for me to be honest. Giselle, can you tell me what the square root of pi is? Apple pie? Are you stupid? Yes. Giselle, I heard Lucas is going to ask you out. Lucas? But he's such a nerd. Hey, Giselle. Hey, Lucas. Do you want to go out with me? Yes. There's no way you said yes. Hey, can you help me with this? This? No way. Yes. Mom, I'm headed to school. Honey, wait. Are you sure you're ready to go back? You know, after everything? It's been months since she's gone missing. 
I can't stay cooped up in my room forever. Things need to start going back to normal. Yeah, you're right. Besides, I'll have my friends. Okay, sweetie. Have a good day. Oh my gosh, Giselle! Katie, hi! You're finally back! Yeah, I decided it was time. Is something wrong? I just got a weird text. What does it say? It says, welcome back. Don't get too comfortable. Who's it from? I don't know. It says it's from A. Probably just someone messing with you. Yeah, let's get to class. I'm Mr. Hughes and I'll be your new English teacher. Giselle, why is Mr. Hughes staring at you? No clue. Maybe he fools around with students a lot. A lot of teachers do. A. What was that? Nothing. Please just let me be happy. Angry. Of course it is. Good morning, honey. Would you like some pancakes? No, mom. Your pancakes are gross. But I thought you loved my pancakes. Yeah, well, I lied. That is no way to talk to your mother. Hey, bestie. Can I help you? Why are you being so rude? Look, I'm just really angry today, okay? Yeah, anyway, does my outfit look cute? No, you look terrible. Giselle, can you give me the answer to number seven? You're the teacher. Aren't you supposed to know the answer? For that smart remark, one week detention. Whatever. Make that two weeks. Hey, I'm new here. Could you please show me around? What do I look like to you? A tour guide? I was just wondering. Yeah, we'll go wander somewhere else. Your emotion is anger, isn't it? So? You could use some of this. Don't touch... me. Happy birthday, sweetie. Thank you, Grandpa. Honey, wait. You'll have to wait until you're 18 to open it. But why can't I open it now? Because this is a special gift. You have to wait, okay? Happy 12th birthday, sweetie. Thanks, Grandpa. Can I open my gift now? No, I tell you every year. You have to wait until you turn 18 to open it, okay? Okay. Happy 15th birthday. Thank you. Guess what? What? Only three years left and then you get to open your gift. Um, yeah, I guess. Giselle, you're 18 tomorrow. You'll finally be able to open your gift. Are you excited? I don't know. I mean, I've been waiting for so long. I don't even know if I want to open it. You have to, and you need to let me know what it is as soon as you open it. Yeah, I will. Happy 18th birthday, honey. You get to open it. Grandpa, what is this? Maybe you could jump in. Or maybe you could scream it. Might be best to keep it. Happy 18th birthday, you can open it now. Grandpa, what is this? Sweetie, I don't feel so good. Grandpa, are you okay? Just go call an ambulance, please. Hi, yes, 911? It's my grandpa. We'll be there as fast as we can, just sit tight. Excuse me, miss, are you Giselle? Hi, um, yes, my grandpa, is he gonna be okay? I'm so sorry, sweetie. We did everything we could. He's gone. I'm really sorry about your grandpa. Thanks. At least you got to open your gift with him. My gift? Yeah. So, what was it? I don't really know. It's a note. Well, if it was a note, I really think you should go read it. Hey, Mom. Hey, honey. Are you fully charged? Yep. I'm all charged up. Don't forget to take your charger. Oh, right. Thanks. I'm going to school. Bye. Hey, Giselle. Hey, Rachel. Can I borrow your charger real quick? I don't know if that's a good idea. We're not supposed to borrow each other's chargers. But I'm running low. Come on, please. Okay, just this once. Here you go. Thanks. You're a lifesaver. I'm done. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Hey, Mom, I'm home. You didn't borrow your charger to anyone, did you? No, of course I didn't. Hey, okay, hun, just making sure. Okay, I'm a little low. I think I need a charge. 
Rachel? Rachel, there you are. Is something wrong? Thanks a lot, Rachel. Thanks a lot. Thanks to you, my charge is not charging on my iPad because it's... I need to go on a date with my soulmate? I need to make sure I look perfect. Hey, do you have some makeup for me? Specifically foundation. I'm going on a date with my soulmate and I need to look flawless. Yeah, the best by She Glam. Okay, great. Let me try it. No way. This is literally covering everything. Oh my gosh, look at the difference. I told you it was the best. I'm going to go finish getting ready. And I'm done. Wow, this is the best foundation I've ever used. My skin has never looked better. Are you ready for that date? Yep, I'm ready. He's here. Mommy, when will I be able to go outside? Once you turn 18, sweetie. But I want to go outside now. No, you can only go outside when you're 18. That's the rule. Hey, Mom, can I go outside? Are you 18 yet? No. Then no, you can't. What's with the long face, hun? Mom, how come we're supposed to follow this stupid rule? I just want to go outside. Stop with this outside nonsense. You know the rules. Yeah, but why? I said that's enough. Go to your room. I just don't get it. What could be so dangerous about going outside? I guess I'm just going to have to find out for myself. I'm going to go grab some stuff from the store. Do you need anything? No, Mom. I'm good. You're not planning on doing anything, are you? No, I'm just gonna watch TV. Okay, I'll see you when I get back. Okay, she's gone. What? So, this is your ATM? Yarp. But you don't have a bank account? Yarp. Well, then how'd you get an ATM card? I don't have an ATM card. Well, then how are you getting money out of an ATM machine? The tones. The tones? The tones! Okay, we keep saying the tones, but I still have no idea what the tones means. Push the button. Wow. See? Every time you press one of those number buttons, you can hear a beep. And this is big news there in your bunny brain? Well, yeah. Z okay, sweetie, what does it say? Mine says famous. That's probably an error. You don't have what it takes. Hey, Mom, I'm off to school now. Study hard so you can make something of yourself. I don't understand, though. It says I'm going to be famous. Why do I have to worry about school? I told you it's not possible. Now do as I say and study hard. Okay. Everybody agrees, everybody. I feel so bad for her. She's so talentless. I can't believe she actually thinks she'll be famous. Me. Hi. Giselle, what are you doing? I'm getting ready for my audition, Mom. Will you please take me? I already told you enough. I'll take you. Come get in the car. Okay, I'm going in. Hey, sis, break a leg. That was an amazing audition. You got the part. You're wearing sweatpants. It's fine. So? So that's against the rules, and you can't sit with us. Whatever. Those rules aren't real. They were real that day I wore a vest. Because that vest was disgusting. You can't sit with us! Spell friends, and I I E N B A. Get that shit inside your head. We're just friends, so don't go. Marco, mom, no, Polo, Marco, Polo, Marco, Polo. You found me, mom. There you are. I almost didn't find you in time. Thankfully, you did. What would happen if I didn't? Something really bad, hun. You have to get to school. If you get picked to play, be sure to yell Marco as loud as you can to get found. I will. Marco! Polo! Ha! I got you. Jessica, that's not funny. The game is serious. Oh, lighten up a bit. It was just a joke. No, this can't be happening. Hey, what's wrong? My little sister got picked and I didn't find her in time. 
Do you know what happened to her? They took her away. She's gone. I'm so sorry. Giselle, please report to the principal's office. You wanted to see me, Mr. Bates? Giselle, you've been picked to play. I can finally see my parents' bank account. Although I don't expect them to make much, we can barely afford the house we live in. What? My parents are millionaires? That means they can buy me my new phone. Hey, Mom. Hey, Dad. What's up, sweetie? Um, can you guys please buy me the new iPhone? The new iPhone? <laughs> are you crazy? But why? There's no way we can afford that. Hey, Giselle, what's wrong? Is it possible for the system to show you the wrong amount of what your parents make? No, the system is always accurate. Why do you ask? Well, because it says my parents are millionaires, and they can't even buy me a new phone. We also can barely afford the house we live in. I think you need to talk with them about it. Mom, Dad, you guys are millionaires. Why are you living in this crappy house? I think we should tell her. Simon says stop putting lipstick on. Simon says? What? Hey, Mom. What's up, hun? Who is Simon, and why is he telling me what to do? Oh no, it started. What do you mean, what started? It's a game. You have to do whatever Simon says. If you don't, something terrible will happen. But be careful, it'll try to trick you. Yeah, I understand. Simon says go to school. I guess I gotta go to school now. Hey, Jessica. Hey, Giselle. So what happens when you don't do what Simon says? Simon says hold up two fingers. We're safe. I'll see you later. Hey, where's Jessica? She's not in class today. The game tricked her. She's gone. Put up your hand. Giselle, no, it's a trick. Come with us. Oh my God. Like, totally. <laughs> and Cena's like, so bitchin'. Just like Mom, Dad, you guys are millionaires. Why are we living in this crappy house? I think we should tell her. <laughs> tell me what? Sweetie, you're adopted. I'm adopted? Are you serious? Honey, we wanted to tell you. I can't believe you guys were keeping this from me this long. I have to go. Hey, Jessica, can I please come sleep over at your house? I'm having some family issues. Yeah, of course. Thanks. Thank you so much for letting me stay here. Your family has a really nice house. I don't think I've ever met your parents before. They're usually gone for business trips. Jessica, come downstairs. They're back. Let's go say hi. Mom, Dad, this is my best friend Giselle. Hi, Mr. and Ms. Smith. You look oddly familiar. No, surely it can't be. Mom, Dad, this is my best friend Giselle. Hi, Mr. and Miss Smith. You look oddly familiar. No, surely it can't be. Jessica, can I talk to you alone for a second? Is that okay, Giselle? Yeah, okay. Hey, I'm back. Oh, you're done talking to your parents? What did they say? They think you're their long-lost daughter. Crazy, right? Um, no. Actually, it's not crazy. My parents told me this morning that I'm adopted. Really? We need to go tell my parents right away. Mom, Dad, Giselle has something to tell you. My parents told me this morning that I was adopted. So you guys made me my biological parents. We need to go take a test to be sure. Yeah, let's go. The DNA test results just came back. Giselle, you are. Freeze tag. Jason, why would you do that? Unfreeze me. No. Mom, please unfreeze me. Oh my gosh, honey, unfreeze. I'm going to get you back. No, I don't want either of you playing this game. Do you two understand? Yes, we understand. Hey, Giselle. Hey, Olivia. Um, where's Jessica? She, uh, she lost in a game of freeze tag. She's gone. Freeze. Unfreeze. Marcus, what are you doing playing this game? Someone could get seriously hurt or worse. 
Oh, relax. It's just some fun. Thank you for unfreezing me. Come on. Let's go. Giselle, there you are. Marcus, stay away from me. Please, I really need your help. Come with me. What are we doing here? Freeze. Ha! Nobody will find you in time. 200 words? What is that supposed to mean? Hey, Mom. Hey, sweetie. Why does this say 200 words left? You have to use all of it before the day ends. If you don't, you'll disappear forever. Yep, sounds pretty easy. I use way more words than 200. Hey, Jessica, how was your night last night? Did you do all your homework? Did you have fun hanging out with Jake? I'm so sorry for talking so much. I'm just trying to use all my words. Okay, you need to calm down and we need to get to class. Giselle, can you give me the answer to number eight? Yes, of course, Mr. Bates. I worked super, super hard on this problem. I struggled with it a little bit, to be honest, but... Just the answer. Yep. 76. Literally all I asked. Hey, Mom. I'm back. And done. It, my thing glitched. How am I going to use 10 million words in five hours? Hey, Mom. Hey, sweetie. Why does it say rock, paper, scissors? You can start playing the game today. What do you mean? If you beat someone best out of three, you win a cash prize. I can win money? Yes, but if you lose, you get eliminated. Don't play. Yeah. I will definitely not be playing. That's my girl. Have a good day at school. Hey, Olivia. Want to play a game of rock, paper, scissors? Heck no. Are you scared? Hey, look, everyone. Olivia's scared. Okay, okay, let's just play. Rock, Rock paper, paper, scissors. Ha! Scissors cuts paper. Rock, Rock paper, paper, scissors. scissors. Yes, I won that round. One more time. Rock, Rock paper, paper, scissors. scissors. Rock beats scissors. I win. Yeah. Hey, Giselle, wanna play? You're so on. Ha! Tricked you. I can see when people lie to me. I think this is actually going to be useful. Hey, Becca. Oh, hey. You never told me why I didn't come over last night. Oh, uh, I was helping my mom with something. Okay. Come on, we gotta get to class. Attention, class, we have a new student. Introduce yourself. Sup, name's Chad. Hmm. That's weird. What's weird? <laughs> Nothing. Kid, right? My name's Giselle, and you said your name was Chad? Yeah, I'm Chad. Anyway, I was wondering if you wanted to work on the science project with me? Uh, sure. Great, we can work on it over at my house this afternoon. No, I'm not allowed to go over to anyone's house. Okay, that's fine, we could do it at a cafe. No, it has to be at my house. Sure. <laughs> can you please buy me some AirPods? Honey, you know we can't afford that. Well, that's okay. My soulmate just bought me some. Later. Oh my gosh, Giselle, did your mom finally get you AirPods? Nope, she didn't. My soulmate did. Damn, lucky girl. Come on, let's get to class. My soulmate just got me an Apple Watch. How did he afford an Apple Watch and AirPods? No idea. However, I'm not going to complain. Don't you think it's weird that your soulmate is able to send you such expensive gifts? I don't know. Maybe he saved up or something. What's with that face? My soulmate wants to send me a million dollars. No way. Don't accept that. It's too risky. Put up your hand. Giselle, no, it's a trick. Come with us. What do I do? I'll distract them. Run! Whoa, why are you running? I'm trying to get away. The Simon Says game tricked me. And now they're looking for me. I know a place you can hide. Follow me. Thank you. Okay, we're here. Thank you for bringing her to us. You set me up. How could you? It was for a reward. I really needed the money. You sold me out for money? That's enough. You're coming with us. We're almost there. 
I'm sorry, but where are you taking me? It's best not to ask any questions. Just keep quiet and follow us. Okay, we're here. Can you at least tell me where we are? We brought you to meet Simon. He requested to see you. Okay, question number one. Let's go. How old are you? That's so easy. I'm 20. What's four plus four? Eight? What kind of questions are these? What color is the sky? Be so thrilled. It's blue. Hey Giselle, how have your questions been? Mine have all been super easy. I only have two questions left. I'm gonna meet my soulmate in no time. Lucky, mine are all hard. Good luck. What liquid is vital to live? Water? Okay, here we go, my last question. What is your brother's favorite color? But I don't have a brother. Mom? Mom? Don't be late for school. I'm never late for school anyway. Hey mom, I'm going to school. What are you doing after school? I'm hanging out with Gemma. Okay, have fun, sweetie. Bye. Hey, Giselle. Oh, hey, Gemma. Do you want to hang out after school? Yes, I would. Actually, I can. I'm sorry. That's weird. Why would my future self tell me to tell my mom I'm hanging out with Gemma and then not want me to hang out with Gemma? Hello, Giselle. Um, hey, Chad. Can you meet me after school? Um, no, I'm going to be busy. You know what? Sure. Meet me in the parking lot after school. I'll meet you there. Chad is weird. Why would future me tell me to go with him? Hey, Giselle, are you ready? What liquid is vital to live? Water? Okay, here we go. My last question. What is your brother's favorite color? But I don't have a brother. What? Mom? Mom? Yes, sweetie? Do I have a brother? Why would you ask that? The system asked me what my brother's favorite color is. Come with me, hun. I need to tell you something. What is it you need to tell me? You do have a brother. I gave him up for adoption because I couldn't care for him. Do you know where he is? I have no idea. I'm sorry, honey. I need to go find him. Giselle, are you okay? You look like you've seen a ghost. My mother just told me I had a brother I never knew about, and I need to find him. But I have no idea where to start. I think I can help you. Honey, today you'll get a letter on your face. You and your soulmate will have the same one. Hey, Mom, look. I already got mine. It's a P. Oh, no, that can't be. Come with me right now. You can't let anybody see that letter. You have to cover it up. Okay, that's perfect. I don't understand, though. Why did I have to cover it up? Because I said so. Don't let anybody see it. Do you understand? Yes, I understand. Now go have a good day at school. Hey, Jess. Giselle, guess what? My letter is an M. Michael is my soulmate. No way. I'm so happy for you. What's your letter? Oh, um, I didn't get one. Don't worry. I'm sure it'll show up. Attention class, the prince is here for his soulmate. The prince? Yes, he's looking for the girl with the letter P. Next. Wait. Give me that. Mommy, Jackson took my teddy bear. No, I didn't. See what happens when you lie, Giselle? You get killed. Don't ever lie. I'm just going to take ten bucks from my mom's wallet. She'll never even know. Giselle, did you take money out of my wallet? No, Mom, I would never. Hmm, I guess you were telling the truth. That's so weird. How didn't I get shot? I lied. Hey, uh, is something wrong? I think I can lie without getting shot. There's no way. Okay, I'll prove it. Ask me a question. What color is your hair? My hair is brown. 
See? Nothing. What? That's so crazy. Excuse me, we're looking for a Giselle Catherine. Um, that's me. Come with us. Okay, Lizzie, are you ready? No, I'm scared. What if one of us dies? We're both going to be fine. Three, two, one. I got 80 years. What did you get? Um, yeah, I got 80 years too. Yay, now you're going to be with me forever. Giselle, your little sister told me you got 80 years. That's amazing. Actually, I lied. I only have two days left. I need you to take care of her when I'm gone. Are you insane? We need to tell her. No, we can't tell her. It's going to upset her. Promise me you won't tell her and promise me you'll take care of her. Okay, okay, fine. I promise. Okay, thank you. <laughs> hey, Lizzie, what's wrong? She deserved to know. You told her? How could you? Lizzie, wait. Giselle, it's Lizzie. Did you find her? Is she okay? She's not doing good. She gave you her time. Mom, can you please take me to the mall? <coughs> Honey, they time it. You have to rhyme it. Mom, can you please take me to the mall so me and my friends can go have a ball? <sighs> Giselle, be careful with the words you choose. I don't want you to be the one I lose. If I don't rhyme, why is that such a crime? People who don't rhyme get killed all the time. Did you do the math homework? Jessica, they time it. You have to rhyme it. What rhymes with homework? Giselle, did you finish your paper? It can't wait till later. Mr. Bates, I didn't do it, but I promise you I'll get through it. I'm giving you one last chance to prove yourself and advance. Can you babysit my sister? I want to go on a date with my mister. I can't. I'm busy. What rhymes with busy? Tell your mom that I miss her so much. Hey, mom. Grandma wants you to know that she really misses you. How do you know that, sweetie? She told me. I... I gotta go. Bye, Mom. Tell my son I don't blame him for the accident. Hey, Jake. Yeah? Your dad says he doesn't blame you for the accident. All this time I thought he did. No, he doesn't. Tell my husband I'm really proud of him. Mr. Fitz? Yes, Giselle? Your wife says she's really proud of you. Wow. Thank you so much. I'll always love you, sweetie. Wait, Mom? No. Dad, where's Mom? Hey, Pumpkin, she's not home yet. You okay? Don't listen to him. He's not your real father. You need to come with me real quick. Okay, since it's my birthday, let's see what sense I'm losing. Emotion? But that's not even a sense. Whatever. Good morning, Mom. I'm going to school. Honey, wait. I have to tell you your grandma passed away. I'm sorry. Uh, okay. Are you not sad? No. Why would I be? Bye. Hey, Giselle, since it's your birthday, what sense did you lose? I didn't lose a sense. Hmm. Is that not a little weird to you? I don't know. I don't really care. Giselle? Yes, Mr. Fitz? You failed your math test once again. You need to get your grades up. Whatever. I don't care. You should care if you want to graduate. Hey, you're Giselle, right? Yeah. Um, can I help you? You lost emotion, didn't you? How do you know that? I did too. And it's really important that you don't tell anyone because... Hey, Mom. Hey, honey. What did you get on your math test? Oh, that? Yeah, I got an A. Well, show me then. She's gonna find out I'm lying. Jake, here you go. Oh my goodness, it says A. Wait, it does? <laughs> I mean, yes. Of course it does. I'm so proud of you. Hey, Giselle, do you have a date to prom yet? Shit, no, I don't. Um, yeah. Jake is coming with me. There's no way. Giselle, are we still on for prom? Yeah, of course. Wait, how... I told you. Okay, something's definitely up. Let me try this. I have an Apple Watch. What? All my lies are coming true. This means I can literally have whatever I want. Hey Giselle, do you want to come shopping with us? Yeah. I am a millionaire after all. 
Wait, what is that? Oh, no. Please let it be anything but my hands. My right hand. Great. Good morning, honey. Hey, Mom. What's going on with you? Nothing. I'm just really excited to see you. I knew I raised a weirdo. Hey, Giselle, can you rate my outfit out of 10? Oh my goodness, that's a 10. So you think it's a 1? No, wait, that's not what I meant. Ugh, you're such a bad friend. I am so gonna get my soulmate back for this. Hey, Giselle. Oh, Jake, hey. Is something wrong? Oh, nothing. Yeah? Do you want to go out with me tonight? Oh my goodness, yes, I would love to go. I'll take that as a no. No, I really didn't mean to. I'm out of here. Jake! Hey, Giselle. Hey, Caleb. Bad day? It's horrible. Your soulmate? How do you know that? Please be a good guy. Please be a good guy. My soulmate's danger level is a three? This is not good. Uh, hey, Mom. What's your soulmate's danger level? It better be zero. Yeah, of course. It's a zero. Good. You know what would have happened to you if it wasn't? We don't allow troublemakers into our family. Yeah, I know. I'm going to school. Hey, Giselle. Is something wrong? You seem worried. My soulmate's danger level is a three. <laughs> now it's a four. Why are you so worried about that? My soulmates don't allow troublemakers in our family. If they found out my soulmate was dangerous, they'd get rid of me too. It keeps going up. I need to find him and figure out why he's so dangerous. Class, welcome our new student, Zach. Wow, he's kind of cute. I heard he's a bad guy. He's been expelled from three schools. Only 20,000? How am I supposed to buy anything with that? Hey, Mom. How many breaths did you get today? Only 20,000. I'm not even going to be able to buy anything. Be careful with your breaths, honey. Don't waste them. Yeah. Okay. Hey, Giselle, guess what? What? I got one million breaths today. I can finally buy a car. Oh, that's great. How many did you get? I didn't get a lot. I only have 15,000 left. Oh, I'm sorry. Maybe it'll be better tomorrow. Well, well, well. Hi, Giselle. What do you want, Mary? Do you want to come shopping with us? Oh, wait, you can, because you're a broke loser. You know what? Just leave me alone, okay? Hey, I just saw that. Do you want me to hack and steal Mary's words?